Hi, this is Jacqueline Sable, and here are this past weekend's top NUC high school performers. North Gwinnett High School of Suwannee, Georgia, started its homecoming party early and put visiting Norcross in the rearview mirror, coasting for a 38-0 victory in USA Today's Super 25 Game of the Week. The Bulldogs, who were ranked number 14 in the nation, slammed the door on Norcross after 24 minutes of play, piling up 28 first-half points to finish off the 7-0 Blue Devils. Senior quarterback Jacob Rudock threw three touchdowns in the first half and led national powerhouse St. Thomas Aquinas to a 45 to nothing bashing of Nova. The Raiders, who were 5-0, scored three times in the first eight minutes of the contest, but stalled a little in the second quarter thanks to several penalties. Rudock was an efficient 9-14 of for 174 yards and showed off his strong arm a few times to hit senior wide receiver Philip Dorsett, who finished with a game-high 109 yards on five catches. Dorsett was one of seven different players who found the end zone for Aquinas. St. Thomas should find things a lot tougher next week when they visit defending 6A state champs Miramar. The Raiders defeated the Patriots 31-6 last season. It took tailback Terrence Tucson only 10 carries to amass 240 yards and four touchdowns. And it didn't take long for his top-rated Trinity squad to put the game out of reach. Fellow running back Joel Campella added 139 yards off 14 carries to help pace a 513-yard effort on the ground for Trinity, allowing the Trojans to dispatch off Halton 48-6. Trinity compiled 628 yards of total offense on the night while improving to 7-0. NUC alum Anthony Davis of Warren Central High School rushed for 156 yards and three scores in his squad's 47-14 thrashing over South. Powered by Davis, who has interest from several D1 programs, and fellow NUC alum Jordan Wallace, Warren Central is 7-1 on the season. Longtime national powerhouse De La Salle demolished Amador Valley 56 to nothing. De La Salle had a jaw-dropping 42 to nothing advantage at halftime and are currently ranked number seven in the nation by USA Today. I'm Jacqueline Sable and that was this past weekend's top NUC high school performers.